Hello guys, welcome to Lucky Tech Techniques. And in this video, uh, I'm going to show you on how to rectify an error that is occurring while I'm trying to edit this page. This is my uh, portfolio. So I was trying to create and unfortunately on the web uh, going, once I update, like I was editing something and I need to update the page. Just have a look. This is the error I'm getting, server error 403. So this means that this error, this this uh, page uh, will not be updated because of that error. Therefore, because once you click update page, this this button will have to change to at least blackish. That's why where we you can see that now the page has been updated successfully. Now that it will not change. What are we going to do to rectify such? Just follow me along to show you how. Now, uh, this website I've already hosted, so you must have at least uh, the logins of your uh, backend logins. That's the backend credentials on your cPanel. Therefore, go back to the cPanel. So after log into your cpanel this is now the page that you have will be uh, redirected after logging into the cpanel now in uh, this like this a page like this it's now your backend so the control panel you can see like here now go to this uh, search and type mods security once you type mods a security uh, this one will pop up and this is now where you are concentrating on just click this and uh, on more security you will get configure individual domains now this is the list of domains that we have you have to know at the back of your mind that what uh, domain are we editing so definitely in my case um try i was trying to uh, update this like juliasoirisha.lactechpro.com so go on your right hand side you can see status here so as you can see i have status on so this one you have to change it back to off like that and once you have turned off you can see a success message successfully disabled more security on lucky blah 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 once so let's go back to where we are on the elementor page builder this page so right now once we click this button we have already changed on the back end but it will not take effect until we refresh this page but to prove you right uh, just update this way like that you can see server error 403 so it will not take effect until we reload this page so you see just click reload this page here click this icon like that then just click reload so let's wait Wow. Now this is the page that we are. Let's try to check it. So uh, you have to understand uh, very well that you see like uh, we have this button here. We have this button here. It's now uh, it's not turned green because we have not changed any changes to this website. But once we even change it a little bit, this button will turn green so as to let you know that there must be some changes so you need to update so let's let's do this so i have to highlight this one and then i come here to style and then for example I just come to typography just click here and then let me just say i need to increase the size you see now the button have turned green so let's say for example i need to leave it that way just for example let me try to update right now when i update it will update 
because we have we did the same the changes sorry so just wait the pattern will turn back to black just that like that so that is how simple it is on how to rectify the error 403 error and it will let you update your website while you are trying to develop anything that you're developing more so while you're using element so that's all about for today and uh, have a nice time thank you very much and bye bye thanks for watching lucky tech techniques channel